Hey friends, so I've spent the last two years pouring myself into writing a new book. And last week I shared on TikTok a video of me receiving the first package of an advanced reader copy of my book, which is like the first print edition of the book with some edits still to come. And that was really exciting for me. And though the book doesn't come out until May of 2025, I wanna share with you a little bit about what queer and Christian is all about. So let's take a look at the table of contents. So what you'll see first and foremost is it's got an incredible foreword written by Bishop Jean Robinson, who is the first openly gay bishop in all of historic Christianity. Then in the first part of the book, I go through my own story, my own journey towards reconciling my faith and sexuality, my journey going through conversion therapy, my journey studying to understand what the Bible actually teaches about sexuality and Christianity. And then in part two, I go through how we can reclaim the Bible. So in this section, I go through the clobber passages and offer the best scholarly interpretation of those passages, as well as looking at how the Bible became anti-queer, how the word homosexuality ended up in the Bible, and all of that good stuff. Then in part three, I go through ways that we can reclaim queer characters in the Bible itself. So I look at Ruth and Naomi, David and Jonathan, Joseph, Jesus and the beloved disciple, and Simeon, the Ethiopian eunuch, as a way for queer people to see ourselves reflected in some of the stories in the Bible. And then this final section is commonly asked questions that I get from queer Christians. And I look at things like, how do I navigate coming out? How do I think about sex and sexual ethics? How do I think about dating and marriage? How do we engage with those who claim to be ex-gay? How do we engage with those who are gay Christians but argue that we must stay within conservative Christianity? How do we engage with family members and pastors and people who are non-affirming? And what does it mean for us as queer people to reclaim our spirituality for ourselves? And a little sneak peek, the book begins with this lovely reflective moment from Dr. John Dominic Crossan, who is widely regarded to be the world's leading scholar on the historical Jesus. And it's just a beautiful little meditation for us as we begin this journey together in this book. The book is nearly 300 pages, but I promise you it's not a heavily academic book. It's a book written for lay people trying to make the scholarship that I've been privileged to study accessible to the average person. And each chapter ends with a little call out box summarizing what I've argued in the chapter. So it should be a really accessible and easy resource for folks who are wrestling with how to reconcile their queer identity with their Christian faith. So if you're a queer Christian, or you're an ally to queer Christians, or you're just somebody interested in this topic, I really hope you will consider pre-ordering a copy of Queer and Christian, Reclaiming the Bible, Our Faith, and Our Place at the Table at the link in my bio. It's available wherever books are sold from Amazon to Target to your local bookseller. And I'm really, really excited for this book to be released in May of 2025.